Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today it's going to be a quick get ready with me. <laughs> my boyfriend's like, it's not going to be, it takes you longer when you're um, doing a get ready with me. But we're going to see the um, new Ghostbusters film today. And I felt like wearing a bit more makeup than I usually do. So ignore the fact that my sleeves are rolled up. I have to do that so as I get too warm. So yeah, you know. Right, so uh, Benefit Poor Fashion. The weather is miserable again today. It's like um, windy and rainy. Whereas yesterday, when I was at work, typically, it was a bit breezy, but at least it was sunny. Like, I was walking home from work, and it was so nice and sunny. Like, I've been trying to walk a lot more lately, like I keep saying, just because. Bit of exercise, bit of fresh air. I've got something on such a couch potato, because I have a desk job, so. Nothing ever beats Poor Professional. <coughs> the only other thing that I do like for like, because it's cheaper and I use it for work now, is this one, the Paulus Partner Primer from Essence. But that's harder to come by, so obviously Wilco's closed down. And like the only pound lines near me are either when I go to my boyfriend's and they don't have makeup in, or like shopping centres. So um, I did try this, the Maybelline Fit Me oh, Matte and Paulus Primer the other day. And yes, it was good, but it still left your face a bit tacky. So that one's better, I think, for wearing under makeup. And a lot of the time I don't wear any like, proper face makeup i'll just put a bit of like cream blusher and a bit of highlight on so that'll probably be better if you're doing a proper full base um i'll try it again though um but if i don't like it that much i'll either give it to one of scott's nieces um or um my mum see if they want it so we're using the revolution forever flawless palette base i'm gonna use your door at the bottom Take a bit of infatuation with this one. Oh, babe. which is this one. And in the middle <coughs> of my eyelid, <clears throat> I'm going to take, hmm, you know what, I'm just going to take a bit of highlighter, take a bit of highlighter, pop it in the middle. the middle of your eyelid for a bit. I mean, I'm actually going to put eyeliner on, so I don't know if I'll be able to see this properly, but. No, I didn't put my eyeshadow primer, eyelid, eyelid primer on, eyeshadow primer, whatever, but I put actual primer on my eyelids, so. Um, the eyeliner of choice is, oh my God, that's rubbed off. I've got a new one. Scandalize um, by Rimmel, and it's in 003 Brown. 
like a shimmery brown colour. Eyeliner done. I do prefer a brown eyeliner now, um, or like a, a bronzy one. This one is sort of like a, I don't know if you can see, but it's like sort of shimmery. I just had for ages, I've preferred them. Right, uh, mascara is kind of free, Rimmel London, and it's in the shade, no, not too brown black. It's very dirty on there because like it's crusted over and stuff, but that's fine. That's mascara done as well. Okay, I'm also just going to put a tiny bit of white eyeshadow in the corner of my eye to brighten it up a bit. So that's eyes done. Can you see a bit better in the light? Blusher is the Cheek Heat um, Tint in 15 Nude by Maybelline New York. The eyes are always the thing that takes the longest whenever you're doing your makeup. So once you get onto this stage, it's fine. I said it before about this blusher. Um, it is just a light tint and it just sort of wear off a bit during the day. So if you're wanting anything more permanent, on your, not permanent, but more like um, pigmented on your face and it's going to last longer, I wouldn't go for this. I'd use either a powder one or like one of the, like the Primark one that I have or the, um, what was the other one? Is it Collection or something? because they're um, more pigmented. This is more just a cheek tint than a cream blush. Okay, and the highlighter reloaded in Dare to Divulge. <clears throat> it's my old and trusty. It's probably expired, but I'm begrudged to buy a new one if I don't have to. Yorkshire woman and me. That is makeup done. Um, I'll get changed and then I'll show you my outfit and do my hair. Oh. Right, I'm staying wearing my Mark Volan t-shirt that my boyfriend got me. I'll show you it properly in a minute. brush and then I'm just going to run um, some of that, um, it's not a curl cream, I'll say that, but it's just like a defrizz cream that I got from Home Bargains. It's the Inecto Naturals Hydrate and Defrizz Hair Serum and it's silicone free natural coconut oil and I literally just put a tiny bit in my hands, run it through, stops it from being as frizzy because when you've slept in plaits overnight Obviously, you're going to get a bit of frizz. Okay. 
Come on, listen to that wind. Good deal. Ooh, we're dropping stuff. Come on, pick that up later. Okay, I'm gonna put one of my butterfly clips in today. Primark, not that special. Literally don't know where that lid's gone, I'll show up for that later. <clears throat> yeah, just in short. Right. So I'll just tie it with a bobble first, because otherwise it wouldn't. I don't, you know, like some people just put the clips in. I know that's the whole point of a lot of them, but my hair just wouldn't stay up. So, pop a little one of these in, soft bobble. And then pop my little butterfly clip in. Check it at the back with my little mirror. It'll do. You see? Tilly! <laughs> right, I'll put my perfume on, then put my jewelry on, and then we're done. Uh, perfume is Jimmy Choo Fever. I'm going to have to change a bit because I to move you to get my jewellery. Mm. Earrings are these little love heart ones, like hoops. Right, rings, little leaf one that I got from York Market a year or two years ago. My bee that I always wear. Then we're going to put my bee necklace on that my boyfriend got me, as always. Be. Right, that's all that done. So this is the outfit look. I've just got my straight leg jeans on from Marks and Spencers. Um, T Rex, uh, Mark Bowen t-shirt, so cool look. Um, and then I've also got just a nice pink sort of long line ish cardigan with like the puff sleeves kind of thing you can also wear them like that obviously um from new look so yeah i'm gonna wear it with let's show you my pink fake platform converse from uh, primark so yeah that's the outfit so with all the rushing round of getting ready um, to go yesterday, I didn't end the video. Um, so as always, thank you so much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed. Um, leave a like, a comment, subscribe if you want to, it is free. Um, hit the notification bell so you get notified every time I upload. <laughs> um, with that said, thank you again so much for watching. Stay safe, stay well, stay you. Love yourself. You're perfect just as you are. And I hope to see you in the next one. Bye, guys.